Hi everyone, Jojo here with another video. So today I've got a couple of completions I'm going to show you. So the first one is of this diamond painting here. So these lovely gonks decorating Easter eggs. Um, I did purchase this on the 17th of February um, this year and um, it did get delivered the next day. I think I bought it on Prime. I did do an unboxing of this and with another canvas. Um, I started it on the 3rd of this month and finished it on the 18th. Um, it was uh, a lot of fun to do. I did do my own little thing, so I've put a little few notes here. So I have used a few AB drills down into the Easter eggs. So I'm just going to get the uh, canvas and uh, show you exactly what I've done. It did take me 11 hours. 36 minutes over a course of uh, 10 days. So yeah, let's move that there. I'll just get the diamond painting. So here it is. Okay, I think uh, this one turned out quite well as well. So I have used, I think it was, let me see. I used 11 different ABs in this one, so um, it was quite fun to do. So down here in the, so we've got a little bit here in the paintbrush, where he's got the paint on the brush, that's an AB colour. If you're new to diamond painting, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, so that's like your Northern Lights, so it gives like a, a different effect, it's like a coating on your normal drills gives just a different effect to the drawers themselves. So where I've got the white, um, I did use the AB version just to bling it up a little bit. And then I've just dotted a few other colors in each egg. I think uh, it turned out quite well. Just see that different sparkle with the ABs. I did use it here on the paint as well. So the paint's like sort of glistening. <laughs> um, and there was a few colors that I had that matched in my, in my AB stash. But um, not not all of it. So some of it's been substituted for other colours, which is why I just made a note of what symbol I used with what AB I used, just so I know if I do lose a drill off here, I do know um, where it was. It is a full round one. But it was uh, a lot of fun to do. I'm so pleased I've been able to get it done before Easter. Um, I haven't uh, started the other canvas yet. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get around to doing that one, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. Um, yeah, it is what it is. Okay, so the next um, one I did was... So, uh, just uh, flip that over. Uh, we'll just put that one to one side. Is this lovely gnome here. Wow, I had no idea it was going to be green, a green hat. It certainly didn't look that way, but I think it's turned out fabulous. I have um, I have sealed this one. Um, this one actually took me two hours and 20 minutes over two days. Um, and I did start it on the 19th um, of this month, 19th of March, finished it on the 20th. Uh, this one was £9.99, which is... $12.59. I can't remember what that one was. Um, it should say it on what I've just showed you on my iPad, but um, did I? I must have put it in. Long to Easter, $4.99. Um, I will put in the description what that is in dollars. I, I'll have to find it. I can't work it out in my own head. Um, so to seal my diamond painting uh, projects, I, I just use this one. Um, I got it off of Amazon. Um, I've not had a problem with it. All my stuff is staying on. I've done a few key rings and they've been sealed with a few Christmas ones, which I didn't get around to showing you guys the completion of. Um, but I'll show you that when we get close to Christmas and I get new stuff in. Um, but yeah, I think this stuff's quite good. I've had it for a while. Just the one bottle. Um, but yeah, no problems with this one so far. But yes, I think uh, I think this has turned out so pretty. I think it's gorgeous, gorgeous done. Such an elegant, all those flowers. So nice. 
Okay, so I did do the unboxing of this as well. Um, this came to me separate from the diamond painting, so it was a separate unboxing. So this slit in the stand was actually a little too narrow. I was able to widen it just using my nail file in there. And unfortunately, I did sort of put a crack in. You can just see it there. Um, but it now fits. So what we're going to do, actually, we'll take the cover, du uh, cover duster. Jesus. <laughs> Uh, dust cover off of this. Ooh. Sorry about the noise. I don't know how loud that was. It sounded quite to me, so I don't like it. Look at that. So when you take that off, that just becomes completely clear. Of course, now I've put a crack in it. That's visible. You can just see that crack there. I think it's annoying, but hey ho. And then we will take the dust sheet off the back of him. Oh, look at that. Oh, so all his edging now is just completely clear. So it's just him standing there with his Easter egg. So let's have a go. Watch. Watch, I've been completely wrong. I have tested it. There we go. I think it's cracking a bit more. There we go. We're in. There we go, look at that. So he will just stand looking all elegant. Look at that. Oh, I've got a drill. Oh no. Uh, ah, I see it. It's all right. I see it. This is just a glue pen that I got with um, a, a, a tile cutter set. So tools. There we go. All done. So I'll let that sort of dryish, and then um, I'll just put a bit more sealer on top of that. But other than that, it's good. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Okay. I'll leave that like that. Just get rid of these. So let's move you up slightly. So they are my two Easter finishes for now. <laughs> okay, um, if you did like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, then please do consider so and do hit that all notification bell so you learn you won't miss whenever I upload a new video. Okay, guys, that's it for this one, and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now. Thank mm -hmm. you.